The Hamptons look is so popular right now, even in the Hollywood Hills. We take a tour of this stunning hilltop residence. Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Tatiana. I'm Gary. Nice to meet you, Gary. And I'm excited because this is my favourite look right now. This is a Hampton style, right? We call this an old world charm Hampton style with yep. a modern transitional interior. Right. So we've given it a different flair. But arriving, there's koi ponds and, and waterfalls, even before I've seen the house. Yes, and you know what all this water incoming through the door means? No. It means money. I love it. I need more of that. <laughs> <laughs> Can we take the tour? Yeah, sure. Let me show you around. Oh, wow. <gasps> Tatiana, this is absolutely beautiful. Isn't it gorgeous? I can really see what you mean now by the old world charm. Yes. And the transitional, because it's a modern house, mm -hmm. but it has the beauty and the character and drama mm -hmm. of a traditional style. Yeah, and it has a lot of heart. That's the difference between a lot of the other homes that you'll see in this area and this one. When you walk into this home, you're immediately drawn into a very beautiful, homey yeah. feel. I really want to go out there, but before I do, I'm, can we see this room? Yes, absolutely. This light fitting has really got me. <laughs> we like to call this the presidential oh, living room. I feel very presidential. Isn't just it gorgeous? Being here. Oh and you gosh. have up to 16 foot high ceilings here, which are a rarity moving forward because all of the new builds in Beverly Hills, you won't be able to do that anymore. Why is that? There are new ordinances that are in effect that okay. won't allow the ceiling height. So this is a gem to have in a house like this. Do you know what? This room, it's the, the proportions of the room, mm -hmm. but the height of the ceiling mm -hmm. and the sun coming in and the fireplace, and the way it's dressed. It's and the greenery. And the greenery, And yeah. all the gorgeous landscaping. You're in the middle of the most beautiful canyon, which is Franklin Canyon, and yep. all that is coming into the property. Yeah. So you don't really miss the exterior space because it's always being reflected in the interior. So what area are we, are we in here? This is called, this is Beverly Hills, yep. 90210, but it's Beverly Crest. Yep. And we're surrounded by all the wow. celebrities, I think if you don't know Jennifer that. Jennifer Lawrence is yes. here. Um, who else is here? There's Adele. so many. Adele. We like to say Adele adjacent. <laughs> <laughs> She's just over here, right? She's right down the street. Uh, Jessica Alba. Wow. Channing Tatum. Wow. Jack Nicholson. I feel the famous. list goes on and on. <laughs> I feel famous just being here. Oh wow. So this. Okay. So dining room and, of course, wine cellar. If, if you're going to spend all that money on wine, why why hide it? Exactly. It's what you like to call the gallery, the wine gallery. This is where your show pieces and really your conversational piece. Yeah. And it allows you to connect to your you know, dining yeah. room and also when you're entertaining. Well, it's practical because you just need to go right there to, to grab the next, the next bottle. 98 bottles of wine on the wall. <laughs> yeah. And there is too. There is. There <laughs> really is. is. Cool. Well, can we check out outside? Absolutely. This is my favorite part. This is my favorite part too. <laughs> I'm home. Where take, do I sign? Take a dip. <laughs> <laughs> I love this, Tatiana. This is so cool. And, and it's so private. And everything has a focal point. Look, if you stand back here, there's a, a shot there. Bang. And as you go to the back of the property, we have almost 27,000 square feet here wow. of land. You actually have different moments to experience on this property, and that's what makes it even more special. Can you just imagine you grabbing a glass of wine and sitting out here next to the pool? I've done it a few times. <laughs> We put a lot of heart into creating moments where people would feel they could have an experience yeah. outside of just a great house. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's beautiful. The kitchen is here. Can we check that out? Yes. This is really cool. There's like a. I always wanted to a have a useful, seat. practical item off of the big kitchen island where when someone is cooking, you can actually sit and, and converse. Can yeah. You can enjoy your view. You can stop what you're doing and have a coffee. An amazing, simple, practical bench idea incorporated into an island like this, we felt was really important in the sort of communal feel here. Just beautiful. This island, by the way, mm -hmm. is absolutely massive. So this is a piece that we searched high and low for. Is that one piece? It is one oh piece, uncut. You have a reverse edge there, yeah. which is cut. But this, we searched high and low for a Calcutta with this specific design. That was craned That was in. this big yep. that didn't have a cut or wasn't bookended. So thank you for appreciating <laughs> it. <laughs> I see a lot of homes and I just, I absolutely love the quality and the thought that's got into this home. There is some developers who will develop a home to sell, 
this is like a home that's lived in, that, that's loved. And many people ask that, has it been lived in? Yeah. And we say no, it's brand new. Yeah. But uh, again, a lot of the details, we're mindful of those things. How would it feel to feel that feeling of living in a property? Yeah. So when you walked into the house, you felt exactly what we were trying to portray, yeah. connected. So bedrooms, how many has it got? How does the house work? We've got five bedrooms, and we've got one bedroom on the main floor, which allows for a guest to have separate access, which is really nice in a property like this, yeah. if you have a mother-in-law, yeah. or you have guests from out of town and you don't want them walking through the house. We have three upstairs, that's where the master is, and they all have views, which is really important Love here. That. We've got city views to the east, and all the way to the ocean on the west. And then we have a bedroom downstairs that we've made a convertible room and you can make it anything that you want. So, so five bedrooms. It's a beauty room right now, right? We call it the beauty parlor. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And then right opposite that is, um, I guess, the man's den. The yeah. theater. Yeah. The theater, which is a, a staple in a house like this. Yeah. You've got, it's a gorgeous state-of-the-art theater. Upstairs? Upstairs, we've got three bedrooms and the master's upstairs. We've got five total, yep. five bedrooms, so three upstairs. We also have, again, when you walk out of the kitchen area, you have this amazing amount of activity that you can go to from an outdoor kitchen to alfresca dining, a coffee area. We have a yoga deck built out for your sun salutations and a gym. Also, out there's, there's a bar almost as well. I mean, it's a barbecue bar area. Yes, that's the outdoor kitchen. I love that. Mm -hmm. And if you're servicing, this is an entertainer's home. Yep. If you're servicing, you could cook outside and serve from the back. You could come through the kitchen. So it's dual purpose here. Love it. Mm -hmm. Well, this takes all the boxes. I haven't seen the master bedroom suite, so I'm holding off giving it a score until I see it. Okay. Can we see that now? You can see it now. So the massive amount of natural light that enters this home does not stop at any of the levels. We've got these gorgeous skylights here. Yep. And what I love about this area is it's a transitional space that can be very useful again for a family with kids. Yep. Oh, this is, I mean, this would have been just a landing that did nothing. And then again, we have a lot of people in the entertainment business. Yep. And a lot of CEOs and hedge fund types that come and look at the house. And this is a great space if you want like a makeshift office. So are you ready for this gorgeous master? I am. We walk into, again, ceiling heights that are really, really gorgeous. Wow, this is so cool. <laughs> Do you know, um, I mean, we talked about um, Hamptons. There, we, we've been to Hamptons and, and shot some houses, and this roof is quite common uh, there. And I love the, just the soaring uh, ceilings here. Yeah. And we have a varied slope here in angles, which was really interesting to work with, and I think just brings a lot of depth and detail and perspective in a room like this. And yep. with the chandelier, of course, it's just so stunning. We have a balcony there. Um, just a balcony? It's a massive bed. It's a Let deck. Me take you. <laughs> okay. Let me take you to this balcony. This is a deck. So here's the gorgeous, massive balcony off the master. Oh, this is so cute. What's so great about this is like, when you wake up in the morning, you want to have your coffee. Yeah. You can sit here and overlook this unbelievable canyon view. Yeah. You could see all the way to the ocean. You can too, and it looks as if we're in a forest here because um, it's all trees as far as you can see. It is, and you're completely engulfed in trees, which creates that privacy. The master bedroom ensuite is yes. just beautiful. It's stunning. It's got a shower big enough to fit 15 people. <laughs> and actually the tile stone that's in there is this gorgeous, gorgeous stone that looks like it's wet all the time. Yeah. It really feels like a spa. Okay. So you might want to charge a membership when you go in there. <laughs> yeah. It's gorgeous. It really is very relaxing. Yeah. It has this amazing soaking tub that again overlooks the entire canyon. Yeah. No one can see in. But Love you can it. see all the gorgeous greenery outside. I mean, that tub, I mean, the um, even the fixtures, the um, the taps, they're just, mm -hmm. just gorgeous. And Everything yeah. is connecting to a design in the light or to the fixture, something that's special. What's your favorite part of this room? I'll say the closet. The closet is... Yes, her closet. <laughs> it's an amazing closet. Yes, she can sit and put her Manolos on <laughs> and then walk out and sit here and have her coffee before she goes to work. A happy wife, happy life. <laughs> love it. Absolutely love it. She needs to be it. happy. Absolutely. Yeah. You are amazing. Thank this you. house is amazing. Thank you. One thing left to know. Yes. Is the price amazing? What's it going to cost us to live here? Just a simple 8.495. Which is pretty good for Beverly yeah. Hills. It's actually an amazing value for this particular location in terms of the, the size of the lot that you get here, which is a hair under 27,000 square feet, and the size of the house, which yep. is over 7,000 square feet in Beverly wow. Hills, Beverly Crest. Yep. Among all the celebrities, 8.495 is a steal. Love it. You've been amazing. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Mwah. Mwah. You've been wonderful. Thank you.